in this video i am going to explain to you all the activities to be done for pest management it will cover all the requirements of all the quality and food safety standards all the standards need food industry to have an effective pest management program in place to minimize the risk of infestation in their organization and keep this fact in mind that pest management is most important activity of any food industry before we see those controlling methods and measures please note the standard requirements different standard requirements for your reference on pest management in ifs version 6.1 there is clause 4.13 in iso 22000 there is clause 8.2.4 and in fssc in iso ts 22002-1 there is clause 12 for pest management. Similarly, in BRC issue 8, got the clause 4.14, SQR code 8, clause 7.2.9, HESAP clause 6.3, and in ISO 9001, which is the standard for quality management system, we can cover pest management in clause 7.1.3, 7.1.4, or 8.5.3. 7.1.3 is the clause for work environment, 7.1.4 is the clause for um, sorry, 7.1.4 is the working environment clause, 7.1.3 is the clause for uh, infrastructure, and 8.5.3 is the clause for uh, preservation of the product. So we can cover pest management activity in these three clauses of ISO 9001. It is very difficult to explain the requirements of each standard on pest management separately. So if we add, mix, and combine all these requirements, a company needs to do the following things in order to comply this pest management activity requirement. Don't forget that this pest management control system for your organization should be based on hazard analysis and assessment of associated risk, including consideration of all the applicable legal requirements of your country and region. Let's start with the task number one. Very first is to make a procedure defining site plan with identification of all pest catching activities, responsibilities, Either it is contacted with any external competent pest management service provider or internal train staff. Then defining procedure about the chemical use, dilution methods, frequency, and schedule of services and inspection records to be maintained, etc. Keep in mind, so what is procedure? Procedure is a specific way of carrying out any activity. So you have to define in procedure about all those things which I have defined earlier. Now task number two. This stage is called implementation. And the most important part, whatever you have written in procedure after risk assessment and planning, time to implement those things. You can divide your implementation part into two uh, divisions. One is inside the factory or number two is implementation outside the factory. So start your implementation. My advice is to start your implementation activities from external part of your industry and try to prevent all the access of any pest coming into your site. For this purpose, close all the access areas and opening areas for the pest. If there are holes on wall, holes on ceilings, close them. If there are no screens on windows or behind the exhaust fan, in place the screens on windows and exhaust behind the exhaust fans. Put the door closers, air curtains or plastic curtains on all the entrances. Keep the outside area clean. There should be no plantation attached to the site. If there are plants, keep uh, trying. It should be properly trimmed and uh, properly monitored and verified. Drain holes or lines should be properly closed. What is your objective should be? Your objective should be to prevent all the access of pests coming inside the factory or your site. Uh, put rat cages, traps on both sides of entrances. Ensure proper housekeeping and do proper fumigation outside the factory. I have visited such companies and audited such companies who got different control measures like rat traps, electric fly, catchers or killers inside the factory. But area is totally or partially open. There is no uh, external or control on access. Then these inside controls are of no use and it's just a waste of time and money. So start your controlling from exterior location and once you are done with your uh, with that external controls now come inside the factory and in place the control measures locate red traps glue traps efks electric fly killers on location based on risk close the drain holes drain lines etc ensure proper cleaning close the dustbin the waste bin when not in immediate use do not 
यूज टॉक्सिक बेड्स विद इन द प्रिमिस और प्रोडक्शन एरिया और स्टोरेज एरिया और विद इन वेयर द वेयर द प्रोडक्ट आर ओपन नाउ टास्क नंबर थ्री यू हैव मेड द प्रोसीजर इन टास्क वन एंड इम्प्लीमेंटेड ऑल द थिंग्स इन टास्क टू नाउ इन स्टेप थ्री यू हैव टू मेक द एविडेंस ऑफ एक्टिविटीज परफॉर्म एंड यू हैव टू लाइक रिकॉर्ड ऑल द थिंग्स एंड मेंटेन ऑल द रिकॉर्ड ऑफ पेस्ट मैनेजमेंट एक्टिविटी ऑल पेस्ट मॉनिटरिंग रिकॉर्ड नीड्स टू बी मेंटेन मोर ओवर इफ पेस्ट एक्टिविटी इज आइडेंटिफाइड और प्रेजेंस ऑफ एनी इन्फेस्टेशन ऑन साइट फाउंड इट शुड बी रिकॉर्डेड एंड आफ्टर सर्टेन टाइम पीरियड ट्रेंड एनालिसिस फॉर ऑल दो मॉनिटरिंग रिकॉर्ड शेल बी कंडक्टेड टू आइडेंटिफाई द ट्रेंड ऑफ पेस्ट एंड देन सब्सिक्वेंटली टेक प्रॉपर करेक्टिव एक्शन रिकॉर्ड ऑफ फूड ग्रेड और क्लेम सर्टिफिकेट शुड बी मेंटेन फॉर ऑल द केमिकल्स बींग यूज मेंटेन देयर एम एस डी एस विच इज नोन एज मटेरियल सेफ्टी डेटा शीट द पर्सन हु इज रिस्पॉन्सिबल फॉर डूइंग दीज एक्टिविटीज कॉल्ड पी सी ओ एंड पी सी ओ इज पेस्ट कंट्रोल ऑफिसर कॉम्पिटेंसी रिकॉर्ड मस्ट बी मेंटेन फॉर ऑल द पेस्ट कंट्रोल ऑफिसर्स एंड ऑपरेटर्स सम स्टैंडर्ड्स ऑल्सो रिक्वायर एन इन डेप्थ डॉक्यूमेंटेड पेस्ट मैनेजमेंट सर्वे एंड टू रिटेन द रिकॉर्ड ऑफ दो सर्वे so that's all hope you will find this video helpful and please give me your feedback by writing your comments in a comment box below and thank you so much for watching this video